Uh, have a good day. Hey, mate, Lucas. Sebastian, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, mate. I'm Andy. Hey, Andy, nice to meet you. Thanks for your help today, guys. Hey, brother, how are you? How you I play with, um... I play with Wells. Oh, yeah? Monday this week yeah. in the qualifier. There you go, mate. My boy. Yeah. He was gonna, I was going to say he played a bit with you at college, he said. I thought it should have landed like pretty close to the stake. The ball just there. It looks like, yeah, it's mine. That is? Yeah. Didn't catch it. You'll see from the strike on the three wood where the grass and the middle of the face haven't had a conversation. Oh, he didn't even give me a big thumbs up. What do you have to do? Thanks, man. Had the, uh, they must have put a sticky note in my shoes to like realise whose shoe it is. And they must have got left in there and I've just put them on this morning, haven't realised it was in there. And eventually it's just all like gotten cold, or gotten wet and soft and stuff. And I'm like, what is in my shoe? That's, um, that's how to look in the hole, isn't it? Lucas Herbert is one under par for Ripper GC, that birdie at 10. Thanks. We're getting into warm territory when the mark is starting to burn you through your pocket again. <laughs> Here you go, mate. Have an extra one. Say thank you, Lucas. There you go. Thanks, Lucas. Have a good day. Stay off the beers, all right? You need to hydrate. No, hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> down left. Cameron's got his washing on his head. Good swing. Hold well on. You weren't getting there in two anyway. Oh, what nailed him? No, it's hit a guy and gone sideways right. You could have pointed your head the other direction. <laughs> you kicked me in the trees. That, I'm so sorry, mate. No. Are you okay? No, brother, thank you. Are you okay? Yeah, brother. I'm fine. You sure? Yeah, yeah. Have we got AMT and stuff yeah, on the way? No, no. Cool. It's fine. I'm man. sorry again, no, mate. No, don't worry. Get How's that not move? Lucas Herbert, at the third for birdie. Ooh. Oh. <clears throat> Gotta be up there for most improved. Oh, yeah. Go left at the end. I've just watched everyone's go that way. What a roll.
Cheers, mate. Well played. Yeah, good point. Yeah, good luck the rest of the week. Yeah, I felt like it was a pretty good round given didn't think I played that good. But no bogeys, just clean it up. So, um, yeah, like you said, only <coughs> three, or four, three or four back there from the lead. So, and, uh, we can play a little better tomorrow, maybe deal with the heat a little better. Hopefully it's not as hot. Um, yeah, just probably take, take care of the par fives a little better. I didn't make any birdies there today, so if I can do that. Um, yeah, we can be right up there with, with a look on Sunday. And Ripper seeking a third consecutive team victory. They are in a tie for third place with Legion 13 and the four aces. Oh, marked up, ready for round two. Second hottest event of the year. Has a foot. Right now, numb. <laughs> Damn it, you did. Have a good one, bro. Hey, Bruce. How are you? Have a good one, mate. Okay. Good, eh? Perfect. Yeah, we're right on top of that slope. Sit right down. Uh, yeah, there's not much that isn't hot about this whole situation. Go, go. Just like fell out the air, didn't it? Hit it exactly how I wanted to. Five and six is a tough stretch to get through early in the round here. Just knock this little four footer in here. Even through two holes, and we're into the, uh, I think we're in the scoring stretch from there. Thanks. I missed that exchange. <laughs> he's tapped in. It's gone. The caddy has gone. Come on, John. We'll, rec we'll, we'll recover from that one. He's like, recover from what? <laughs> this is just straight left to right. Yeah. That's what that flag's showing as well. That's what the water's showing. Yeah. It's got to be bang on eight on, doesn't it? Yeah, I think so. It'll make sense. We've got 180 back edge. I think we needed a bunch of help on that fifth hole to get 
one eight. Oh, it was like eighty one or eighty two out of an eight iron, wasn't it? I think that pushed eighty two, yeah. It was a bit trap hooky, like. Yeah. I, I just don't There's think. Definitely it. more help. Right? Pretty stockish at the hole then. Yeah, you like being aggressive on that line. Yeah, I do. Giving a lot. Sit. Yeah, sit down. Ah. Shorts was the play today. Good goal. It's so bad, it's actually a decent leave. Yeah. Thanks. That was always in. The bit where it should have broken left never did, and the bit that it should never have broken left, it snapped at the end. Uh, ramen noodles, ramen noodles in the left trap. Chikara is just there. Oh no, they're both. They're both in the fringe. Sorry. No, no. Bad. Uh, that's you, yeah. Thanks, mate. Hope it gets better for you, dude. Sit. Sit! Sit! Thanks, mate. Go f and win next week, eh? Thank you. Sorry, man. No, fine. Go win next week, eh? Lucas Herbert in stereo. It's second at 11. Beautiful. I don't know Spanish, but that didn't sound like I'm so happy with that part. What the hell? <laughs> Get down there. Basketball shot. Jesus. Oh, she's not doing anything, is it? It'd be fine, it just didn't cut at all. I thought I had a decent swing at it too. Stand up where? Huh? What do you want to do? Do you want to this down from a visual perspective? Nah, it's fine. Oh, yuck. It's f dead firm there. Go f off. Down slope, down grain, it doesn't run out like that. Lucas Herbert, year 12. Yeah, well done, mate. That was never in, by the way. <laughs> that has broken so hard late. Nice warm milkshake for me. Yeah. Lucas Herbert for birdie at 13. And Lucas Herbert is five under par, and Ripper are 14 under. How about me just hanging on to my logos on my shirt? <laughs> You're hanging on to those like John. I'm, on to I'm, a, I'm a ripper for the moment. I'm about to be a rip. Could be an ip. Oh, f***ing hell. How hard's that going at the end? Kind of open the wind might have just held that a little bit there. <laughs> F 
gone right. Run me through that. Drains there, wins there, slopes there, goes right. I don't get that. Run me through how that goes right, Nick. And like not bobble right. It's gone a long way right. Went half a cup left to right. What kind of shape you going in? Are you holding it against it or are you? No. Let it go with the wind. Yeah. Hit it at the flag and let it fall onto the lollipop then? Sorry, the lollipops. Right of the hole. Yeah, I know you are. You know what I mean? Yeah. Straight right to left. Wind's doing everything while I'm over the ball there. Thanks. Oh, mate, putting's so easy, isn't it? <laughs> I reckon that was the only putt I didn't hit in the practice round. I reckon I hit every other putt, but I was like, I didn't hit that one. So I was like, when I hit it there, I'm like, oh. Wonder what this will do going up there. I haven't really hit this part. Oh, that was a bit snatchy. snatchy That's enough. snatchy. Idiots! Hit the f***ing line! This is such a bad part, mate. Great tee shot on 18 out of Lucas Herbert. Just a lofted club in, looked like a wedge. Beautiful, beautiful play on what was the hardest hole on the golf course yesterday. Yeah. So you can stay like, stay reasonably aggressive on that pin then. Absolutely, yeah. Stay pretty straight, isn't it? Just missed the spot there. Got it on the edge just because of the grain. The grain's, coming back this way. grain's like at two o'clock, two or one thirty on the hole. Which you would normally be outside the hole, right? What do you say? Do you think ordinarily it's outside hole? I think without the grain it is. So it, it so grain's just going to add to it. Okay. Depends what speed you're hitting it at, but you know what I mean. Yeah, I'm not bashing it. Lucas Herbert to finish his day with a birdie. That at number four, he's in at seven under three back right now, heading into the final round. Two good reads to finish there. Thank you. Good job. Well played. Thank you. Come on, Thank you, mate. Yeah, play well tomorrow, tomorrow, man. Pretty happy with it. I think that's the best I've hit it all year, which is a lot of confidence. Um, we've worked on a lot, so to feel like we're at a position where I don't feel like I'm making any adjustments on the golf course. You know, everything feels quite neutral and square, and that's exactly where it is. It's that's a pretty good feeling. Um, yeah. Didn't make as many putts as I would have liked. Obviously, a couple of good ones there to finish. I'm just really struggling to read the greens this week. Um, you know, Peewee's really helped me out helped me out there the last two holes with some reads, which ordinarily he never reads greens for me. So, um, yeah, it was a nice little finish there. Um, gives me some good momentum going into tomorrow, into tomorrow. Sort of saved the team a little bit there. Looks like we might have struggled a little bit today. So, keep us on track and, and give us a chance tomorrow to three-peat. Well, a wildly entertaining Super Saturday here at the Golf Club of Houston. And this is how it looks going into Championship Sunday. What's going on, mate? Have a good one. Have a good one, mate. Have a good one, bro. Yeah. Play well, boys. Lucas Herbert playing his second at two. Lucas Herbert's in good form, a 68 for him yesterday. He's seven under par. Ripper GC with a lot of work to do in the team competition. They trail by nine, looking to make it three in a row. I watched his putt and it's like, you can see it's like diving into the grain 
like that wall that way. So I automatically think I'm probably just, I'm probably on like a 7.30 line. Lucas Herbert Thanks. within two of the leaders. That's good news for Ripper GC, an early birdie for him. Good read, it moved like half a millimetre, left to right. That pitch mark there, just left of it, in sort of that way. Yeah. Lucas Herbert at the third. This for birdie. Bend in right. Keep up the speed. No. Pretty hard visually to match up, like what it's actually doing to what you're seeing. I'll just throw it out that far. Yeah. Even though you just seen this, you go. Come and stand over it. You don't you, you don't feel this leaking left at all. Like you don't feel like where your left foot is is a low point. Play it dead straight. Yeah. Okay. And this is Lucas Herbert for his birdie at four, and he makes hey. it. Oh, it's getting close in the team competition. Plenty of golf to be played. Thanks. Lucas Herbert within two of the individual lead. Ripper within five, and about to get closer. So we move ahead to five and Lucas Herbert. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> He's swinging nice, David. Yeah, right at it. Just a couple back. Cop and a half. Thinking it's reasonably straight through that first section. Are you, feel, are you saying the same thing? Yeah. Got to go in at like 7.30 almost? Yeah. Meanwhile, at the fifth, another opportunity for birdie here for Lucas Herbert, which would momentarily at least draw Ripper to within one. Both Jones and Leishman have parred the 14th after excellent tee shots at the par three. I hit it where he wanted, he hit it with the right speed. Yeah. Just didn't go. Yeah, it just didn't quite do as much as we thought. It's not like that, that part is not that far away. Back to three, here's Lucas Herbert, who's only two back of the leaders individually, teeing off at six. Pretty meaty par four here, 460 yards. Part of the first two days. One seventy six higher than his average ball speed and doesn't hit it through the fairway. Excellent position there. What a day so far for Ripper GC looking to go three straight. They trail the fireballs by just two. Lucas Herbert playing well as well. He's two under par today. His second shot into six. And there's another birdie opportunity for Ripper GC. Just swinging as well as I've ever seen him swing, and I covered him when he won his one event in his previous career on the PGA Tour in Bermuda. This is for birdie. Oh, it started on at the right six. line, but just hopped a little. Oh, well, that wasn't supposed to turn left at the end. Did not say it going back left at the end. I think there's going to be a lot of people who are going to miss that part left for that. Come back here and look at it knowing what you know. You still can't see it going left at the end. No, like, and you've seen the putt already. Back with Herbert on the seventh tee. Sit. 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 Lucas Herbert for birdie at seven. And uh, Ripper GC won in Singapore their second consecutive team title. That was in spite of a 74 on the last day by Lucas Herbert, who had contributed over the opening two days. But at the moment, all four of the Aussies are playing superbly. 
So over the trap. Nah, it's, yeah, it bounced. It needs to roll like a ball inside Wolfie's mark there. Are you happy with that? Yeah, I am. To the green at eight, and Lucas Herbert, another birdie opportunity for the Australian. And he takes it beautifully. And Ripper GC once again level with the fireballs on 30 under par, and Herbert well is within two of the lead. Fourth. Fine, pitching up here, isn't it? I think so, yeah. Fine, plenty. Lucas Herbert on the tee at nine. Gave that the full treatment. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Lucas Herbert, three under par for his round so far today. There are no weak links today in this Ripper lineup. They're 13 under as a quartet. Watch it. Is this trouble on the right? I, 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 I. Oh, caramba. TV, see anything? I'm always going to be on the fairway. Dear. Now then, Lucas Herbert, remember he drove it into the water. This is for par at 11. Oh, it's got a chance. Oh, not far away for Lucas Herbert, but he drops to nine under and Ripper GC dropped to 30 under par, trailing by three. Uh, so well played, dude. So well played. Thank you. Great out, great out. That was uh, that was pretty nice. That will look pretty good from down there. Thank you. Go. Go. Jesus Christ, Lucas! What are you doing? Making life hard for yourself. I'm looking at that going, dude, you gotta hit it. You gotta get it over. Like, you can't just have it fall over the top of that ridge. Yeah, it yeah. needs to have some speed. I'm like, I know you've gotta hit this. I know you gotta hit this. And then sit there, like, stood there and like, I still didn't hit it. <laughs> See on top of left edge, downgrade that way. It's on top of there. Yeah, cool. Uh, Thanks. Great read, Pewie. You've got no idea how much more confidence it gives me when you're seeing the same thing. I'm certainly with you that I don't want to fly it up top. Ripper GC's attempt to win three consecutive team titles is fading. Well, we were, I reckon we were 28 when I stood on that green. And I've made a birdie, so we should go to 29, and we're at 23. Yeah. <laughs> I'm guessing we're not in second place anymore. Tied fifth, yeah. There it is, way up there. It's gone under there with heat. Yeah, it's way in there. It's in there? Yeah, it's way under. See, I told you it went under there. Yeah, she was right. Hello, mate. Stud one, get under the grandstand there. Yeah. You can see it through the hole if you want to you verify it. I don't, know that you, I don't know that you're going to get that way and not be, not be closer. That's my point. That's what I'm saying. I think we're going to have to go that way, right? That's what I'm thinking. Happy with that, mate? I think you're clear there. And then within one club equal that. If it goes close to that tee, we're going to drop it again. Gotcha. Try to drop it again. Yeah, right here. Yep. Spot three, two. You're in play. Cool. Thank you, mate. Yep. Oh, 
by York Skidding. How have I kept that short? I didn't think short was going to be our issue. Shot, Thank Great you. Shot. Is that? It's on a decent line, sort of like a foot out. Just bobbled right. It's just, bo it's just bobbled. Even that one, you can see it just... Yeah. Trap or short of it? So it's in the trap. Just waiting to see if I saw it come swinging right round. The trap's probably not that bad, actually. Get some spin out of that. Correct. Easy. Easy! Well done, mate. Great fun. <laughs> Thanks, Wolfie. Enjoyed it, mate. Yeah. Yeah, it was a pleasure. See you in a week or so. Thanks, mate. Yeah, good, good plan. Good deck. You too. Enjoyed it. Thanks, man. That chip on, that chip on 18. Good week, mate. Thanks, Kenny. Enjoyed it, mate. Woo. Cheers. <laughs> good work. I was just thinking. One, oh, I was never in. It was so low. It was so low. Thank you for keeping me cold as well as uh, everyone else. Really good job. Yes, man. Very proud. Um, it's the best I've hit it all season, comfortably. It's the best I've hit it in a long time. Um, so there's a lot of positives to take there. I think we've done a lot of work this year and we're sort of really starting to see the, the dividends pay off there. Um, probably the best I've played on a, on a final round there for a while as well. So it's so a lot of good positive notes to close out the week. Um, I really struggled with the heat in Singapore and, and was sweating a lot and you know couldn't hold onto the club and really felt like that was an issue and the same thing at the PGA for me. So I felt like I combated that well as, um, this week as well. So. Just so many positives to take out of this week, so many things to be proud of. Um, you know, it's my best finish on live so far. Um, tied six, I feel like that should get me up in the points standing a little bit closer to maybe what's been reflective of the way I've played this season. So, um, yeah, taking a lot of positives out of Houston and looking forward to Nashville.